Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how you can replace your kidney grills on your F2X, 3X, and F8X chassis BMWs. To start, we're going to need to remove this weather stripping right at the front of the bumper. Um, you can start on one of the sides like the headlights and just get under here and peel it off. You can see it just comes off quite easily and uh, this channel in the weather stripping fits right along this ridge going along the bumper. With the weather stripping removed, it'll expose all of these different Torx screws. Um, the ones along the center main area are T30, and these two ones on the periphery are T25. We'll want to go ahead and remove all of those. Next, we need to pull this part of the bumper forward and out of the various clips. So there's like a clip here on the, under the headlight, and there's these metal clips uh, along the body. So I'm just going to scoot it forward out from under those clips so that we can pry it up and out like this. If we look at a grill, we notice that it has these clips all around the periphery and this is what clips it into the body. So our goal is going to be to pry the bumper forward, reach in behind there and release the clips from the body so we can pull one of the kidneys out. Once one of them is out, it's really easy to just stick your arm in through the empty side and release the clips on the other kidney. So here's a good look uh, behind the bumper at one of the clips of the kidney grills. So you can see we're just looking to press down on that center part and then push the clip out from the front. So not too bad to reach to. Now we can take our new grills, align the tabs with the holes, and just push them into place until they snap. Now that the kidney grills are in, we can go ahead and slide the front bumper underneath all of the clips. So remember there's one on the headlights and then all these metal ones throughout the body. And then we can go ahead and screw in the various uh, Torx screws. Now these guys get torqued to 4.6 newton meters or 3.4 foot pounds, basically just snug. Um, one thing you will want to note is you'll probably want to put all the screws in first before you do your final tightening because how you would slide this panel part of the bumper forward and backwards will determine how much of a gap you have between this and the hood. Now we'll go ahead and take this weather stripping. We'll look for the channel in it and we will just pop it along the ridge, put, press it back into place. So with the close of the hood and checking that you're happy with your uh, bumper to hood gap, that's it. We're done changing our kidney grills. Take care, guys.